You know, when you when you get a, a three or four missed phone calls from your GM, uh, you know, your heart starts to race a little bit. You uh, start playing all types of scenarios uh, in your mind. Um, but I kind of had a feeling, you know, with the direction the Braves have been going this offseason and uh, the direction they've been going uh, during the course of the past season, you know, you kind of knew uh, there was a chance, that, you know, that you may be in a move or uh, a deal, you know, in the future. And, um, you know, fortunately I was able to play well enough to where, um, you know, uh, a deal was made with the, with the old team and, you know, kind of getting a chance to make a full circle trip back to Detroit and, uh, you know, put on the Tigers uniform again. and. You know, uh, it's you know mixed emotions. Um, you know, uh, bittersweet. You know, uh, it was an exciting year to be able to play in front. Of, you know, uh, not only the Atlanta fans, but you know, for me, it was like a hometown crowd. Um, all the support that I received was uh, amazing. You know, very thankful for that. Um, you know, all the people came out and supported me from from home. Uh, it was an amazing year, and uh, now I'm, I'm excited to go play for a playoff contender. You know, at this point in my career, being 28, um, I think I'm at a point in my career where I can help a help a team do some special things. And um, you know, uh, fortunately for me, it's a chance to go and, and help the team who drafted me. Uh, I get to play with, you know, in my eyes, the best hitter in baseball, and uh, Miguel Cabrera. So. You know, I expect my game to be elevated to another level, playing with guys like that, and uh, I'm just excited for the for, for the new opportunity. Right. Well, and I, I saw on Twitter that you thanked the people of Atlanta and the, and the Braves organization for their, you know, how they kind of helped you and, and and let you play with them. How thankful are you to the to the Braves? Uh, you know, very. You know, I told John, I just uh, very humbled by the opportunity that I was given this this year. You know, uh, leaving San Diego, putting myself in a situation where, you know, I was able to, you know, kind of put myself back on the map, so to speak. Let everybody know that I'm um, not only a big league player, but a productive uh, and above average big league player at that. You know, a guy who can, you know, do a lot of exciting things on the baseball field and, um, you know, thankful for the opportunity that they gave me and, uh, you know, thankful that they gave, uh, you know, my people, my, my, my friends and family back home opportunity to watch me play at the highest level and that's the major league level. So, uh, you know, it was a, a true blessing this year and I'm excited to keep it going. Absolutely. How much fun are you still having playing this game that you love, man? Uh, you know, a blast. You know, I think at this point in my career, you know, I've got a big smile on my face because, you know, it's a part of the business, you know, and, uh, you know, being able to, you know, uh, be on a journey and, and take the journey that I've taken, um, it's exciting, man. This is what I love to do. Um, you know, I, I exude the passion for it on a daily. Um, you know, I, I took five days off and I'm back in the gym. It's just like, this is what I love to do. And, uh, you know, I, I'm going to keep doing it until they take my jersey away from me. Yeah. So now just hanging out here, obviously trying to stay in shape, but you kind of trying to relax a little bit too in the offseason? Yeah, you know, uh, I love to hang out at home, love to relax. But again, you know, one thing I enjoy is coming back home and uh, getting to see the, the, the young talent, you know, the, the high school talent and the, the middle school talent. You know, uh, I, I'm a big fan of watching youth uh, youth athletes and, uh, you know, the, the, the kids that stand out. And, um, you know, I've been following Reynolds all year. They've, they've had a great season going on, so I'm really for him tonight. Um, you know, hopefully I get a chance to, you know, uh, watch Rico do his thing and continue to <laughs> To, um, you know, excite people around here, and uh, yeah. you know, uh, I love being home and spending my, my off season right here. Yeah, it's a mountain, man. Got it. Can't gotta love it. You know, it doesn't get too much better than the mountains. Okay.